20 miles off California's coast, in the deep blue Pacific Ocean waters, a clean energy revolution is in the making. One that promises to bring big benefits to Golden State residents by creating new jobs and investment in our port communities and help California meet its climate, clean energy, and grid reliability goals. Large floating offshore wind turbines assembled by California workers and spinning out of sight to most shore dwellers, are poised to play a vital role in ensuring the state's renewable energy future as part of a diverse, clean power portfolio that keeps the lights on and electric grid humming around the clock. California has long been a leader in climate and clean energy, but when the sun goes down and solar panels go dark, California residents need an alternative renewable energy source. Turbines tapping offshore wind supply power from strong, steady ocean winds that blow night and day and deliver among the highest capacity factors of any renewable energy. That makes offshore wind an ideal complement to California's ample solar energy supply. In August 2022, California determined that to reach the state's 100% clean energy and climate goals, it needed to go big on floating offshore wind, adopting ambitious ambitious planning goals to generate up to 5 gigawatts by 2030 and a nation-leading 25 gigawatts by 2045. How much electricity is this? As much as 12 Diablo Canyon nuclear power plants, enough to supply 15 to 20 percent of California's new clean energy resources and power up to 25 million homes. In December 2022, the Biden administration held a first-ever federal auction for California offshore wind, identifying five initial leaseholders to begin deploying floating turbines off the central and north coasts. California is setting a course to be a global leader and hub for floating offshore wind. But while the state is making good progress, it also faces challenges and a lot of work to deliver this remarkable renewable resource at scale. In May 2023, state and federal officials joined industry leaders and other key stakeholders at the Pacific Offshore Wind Summit to assess California's path ahead to make floating offshore wind a reality. The opportunity which we're seizing now to go bigger and bolder and faster towards a future powered entirely by clean energy. The U.S. has a real opportunity to be the global leader in floating offshore wind and the Pacific can help lead the way. It is amazing in the span of less than five years how far offshore wind and everything that comes along with it has advanced in the Pacific. Governor Newsom is committed to a future of offshore wind in California. We are on a path to achieve our 100% clean energy future. The future happens here first. We're America's coming attraction. We're laying out a specific strategy to actually achieve our audacious goals. We have laid out ambitious markers, 2045, not just 100% renewables as it relates to our electricity grid, but carbon-free future in the state of California. One of our specific goals in 2045 is 25,000 megawatts of offshore wind. Offshore wind will deliver a host of benefits for Golden State residents workers, and electricity rate payers. Create tens of thousands of good-paying, skilled, and trained jobs. Save rate payers billions of dollars in installed, clean power capacity. Help residents avoid the kind of rolling blackouts California narrowly averted in September 2022 deliver real environmental and public health benefits by reducing dependence on fossil fuel plants historically clustered near disadvantaged communities, all while coexisting with other ocean users and protecting California's coastline, coastal communities, cultural resources, fisheries, and other marine life, which Golden State residents have long held as a sacred trust. These are the essential next steps that must be taken to deliver these benefits and bring California offshore wind online. Investments in port upgrades and transmission to deploy and deliver offshore wind power to electricity users. Procuring at scale to ensure offshore wind power reaches ratepayers at the lowest cost. A clear permitting roadmap to ensure a timely, efficient process of environmental reviews and approvals. Engaging with stakeholders to ensure we protect our environment, marine, and cultural resources. 
a sustainable supply chain and workforce training to make sure California is ready for these new jobs, and suitable sea space for more call areas to reach California's 25 gigawatt goal. The technology required for floating offshore wind in deeper West Coast waters is already present in pilots off Scotland, Portugal, and Norway. California has the opportunity to be the first to deploy floating offshore wind and deliver its benefits to residents at scale. California knows how to be a clean energy leader. The time to act is now.